We are back in the kitchen with Chef Bob from the Longboat Key Club. And, oh, Chef, what do you have here today? It's looking pretty amazing. Well, already. we've got a, a, a wonderful white bean chili where the base is, is turkey. Mm. So we wanted to figure out a way to use up that extra turkey or that leftover turkey from, from the holiday. And after you have those delicious turkey sandwiches right after, you know, right after uh, your, your turkey dinner, you want to have that something to do with that with the remainder of that dark meat mm -hmm. and and some of the other <laughs> it's called hide the dark uh, meat. hide the dark meat <laughs> so this rich and savory dish is is something that we we put together to be a way to keep everybody happy it's quick and it's easy so we're just going to start right now by okay. by by starting with the base of the uh, the recipe and um, and the base of the chili so we're starting with a little bit of vegetable oil and if you ladies could help vegetable. me we yeah so i've got some onions right here These if you are want the onions? no no the onions are right here. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. So oh, you just, just learned how we cook. <laughs> we clearly and then we've got some lovely poblano can... peppers here. That so we get a little nice. earthy yeah. and a, a little earthiness, a little spiciness. So we're going to get those and we're going to caramelize these these nicely on the pan. I'm not sure what that is. And that is a little bit of garlic. Uh -huh. In just a second we will. Okay. So we want to we want to get these this the sautéing in the bottom of the pan. Okay. If you want to watch that and keep that going. You. Okay. And then, we're gonna, right, and then the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add some of those jalapenos on that ah, spoon right there. Ooh, now we're yeah. talking. So now we're going to talk. We're going to spice it up okay. a little bit. I'll give you your okay. job back. Yeah. Okay. And uh, now. So just the vegetables so far. Yep. yep we're just putting the vegetables in. We want to get them sautéed nicely. And is that just till they're soft? Is that how we know? Right. We, I, actually, I like to get a little bit of a, a golden color mm -hmm. on oh. the uh, rather than just translucent, so we get a nice rich flavor going okay. through the through the chili. And then we're going to add our garlic once that happens. All so right. we're going to add the garlic in there, and that's going to mm, that's going to cook can for smell us. That. Yes. So, but here comes the here comes the fun part. Okay. This is the this is the part that makes that chili nice and fragrant and rich and delicious. We've got some. Spices here. So if you want to start out, we've got a an ancho chili powder there, which is chili real, powder. Yeah, Ooh. chili powder. We're going to put that powder. right in. So is this a spicy dish on the whole? It, it has. It does have some spice to it. I would okay. say it's more robust than it is spicy. Mm, fair well, enough. Okay. What is this? What is this? Okay, we've got some cumin here that you we're going to put. You want the cumin? I do. I do. We're going to put cumin that right in. in. We're okay. Gonna, okay. And we're going to. This is that's some ground coriander. Ground coriander. Yep. Are I'm, you ready? For I it? am ready. Okay. So we're going to get those spices in there and get them. Get them cooking oh, up in the smells heat. Smells amazing. Yeah, oh, and really? then we're going to add a little smoky paprika. Smoky Ooh. paprika yeah, okay. coming up. Okay. okay. So we're going to get those good, and we want to get those the 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 the, uh, uh, the spices nice and warm, mm -hmm. so that the fragrance comes out, so it permeates the rest of the the chili. So as we do that, we're going to get those. Those, those spices cooking and, and releasing all their essential oils and their flavors. And then we've got some cooked beans, we've got some cannelli beans or some white beans that we cooked up in advance. And can some, you use and the canned beans? You can know. use the canned beans. I recommend that you just drain the, the, uh, the beans off before you use them. Okay, that's and, but, but we're gonna, again, um, because the beans were cooked in, in advance and we did cook them in some turkey stock, we're gonna, ah, with these. They're gonna be a little better than the, canned. They're gonna be a little bit better, they're gonna be a little richer, but we're gonna get those, we're gonna get those spices rolling around that too. So we're gonna cook those beans up a little bit. That already looks good. Good, mm -hmm. yeah. good. So we've got some wonderful flavors going on. Okay, and then well, as we get as we get a little further along here, we'll let this cook or simmer for about a minute or two. How long that would would that normally simmer? I would say about a minute to a minute and a half. Oh, I don't want to well, burn the beans. Well, while you simmer, let's go ahead and plate one for Absolutely. us. Absolutely. You can, Bo Beth, you doing the honors? I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> Scoop right, it on give that in a good there. Mix there. Once we oh. get yeah, the turkey in, the the rest of the spices in, how long does it actually simmer on the stove? How much cooking time do you, I need you to allot? You basically look at a total total cooking time about two hours. Two okay. hours. So, so okay. again, this is a dish that you can do while you're watching the football game. You can come back and forth. It's not something that you're going to have to sit and babysit. Once you get the initial the initial base of the recipe going, and we add the stock here. Oh. He's going to add that to the, and we're gonna add to this the to working here. thing. I and am topping with some cheese. And is this cilantro? Mm hmm. That and is some cilantro. We're going to put a little lime in there. <laughs> Look at that. That is red actually, pepper. we're going to actually add the cilantro now. We're going to add about half the amount of cilantro here. And I'm sorry to reach in front of you. All That's right, fine. Chef, while you go ahead and finish that up, I am going to remind everybody that leftover turkey can be put so easily into bean soups. You don't have to just get stuck with sandwiches. Lots of great ideas from Chef Bob at the Longboat Key Club. A nice one. Linda, thanks for joining mm, us. Thank you. Great to see you. Bo Beth, don't spill my lunch. <laughs> <Don't get it. laughs> we are going to continue dishing this up and enjoying. You're back to work, mm -hmm. girl. Enjoy the rest of your day. Take some time and enjoy the Sun Coast view. Thanks, Chef. Thank, thank you. you. We may have to use these. <laughs> there you go. I'll darn it.